The fire broke out this afternoon in a fifth floor apartment here in the Marlboro houses. You can see the building behind me on the fifth floor. There's boarded up windows. EMS tried to do everything they can to try and save the 63 year old man. But by the time they got him to Coney Island Hospital, he had died. I'm sad that this even happened to him. Instead of getting out of the burning apartment, sources tell us the victim was trying to put the fire out himself. Police say the 63 year old had burns over 60% of his body. Just seeing that though, like anybody like third degree, that's horrible. Police were not releasing the victim's name pending notification of his family. Sherry Anthony says he went by the name Hoagie and always went out of his way to help others. He asked you if you need anything from the store, if he was going, if an uh, old lady had a cart bringing up the, you know, up the stairs, he would help, help out, things like that. The fire broke out around 1.40 in the afternoon. People who live in the building quickly evacuated their apartments. I was home when it happened. I smelled the fire and everything. Were you worried? But I didn't, worried? I, I, automatically, I took my girls out, but I didn't expect this to happen. I have kids in the house. I was scared. People were back in their apartments tonight as crews worked to board up the broken windows. What exactly caused this fire is still unclear. The fire marshal is investigating. In Gravesend, Rob Hoyle, PIX11 News.